Last week our thoughts each day focused on asking the question, what is church? This week we're asking, what is church for? Yesterday the answer was, church is for everyone. And today I want to remind you that church is for friendship, for caring for one another. One of my favourite passages of scripture is from the end of Acts 2. They devoted themselves to the apostles' teaching and to fellowship and to the breaking of bread and to prayer. Everyone was filled with awe at the many wonders and signs performed by the apostles. All the believers were together and had everything in common. They sold property and possessions to give to anyone who had need. Every day they continued to meet together in the temple courts. They broke bread in their homes and ate together with glad and sincere hearts, praising God and enjoying the favour of the people. And the Lord added to their number daily those who were being saved. This is the very first church. And what was it for? It was for meeting together, eating together, praying together. It was for making sure that anyone who had need was cared for. It was for praising God. Thinking today of that first church, getting together to share a meal every day, it makes me a little jealous. It sounds just like a family, doesn't it? Catching up on the day's events, making sure the kids have warm coats to wear and that Uncle Bob has a good meal in him before he leaves. Sharing what they have with each other without worrying about being in debt. This is what church is for. Friendship, fellowship and care. I wonder if this is your experience of church. I wonder if this is the sort of place you endeavour to make church for others.